can we go to the big picture of the criminal justice system? What do you, given the ideal, works about our criminal justice system and what is broken? Well, there's a lot broken uh, <laughs> right right now, and I usually focus on on that. Uh, but uh, in truth, a lot uh, works about our criminal justice system. So there's a there's an old joke, uh, and it, uh, it it it's funny, but it it carries a lot of truth to it. And the joke is that um, in the United States, we have the worst criminal justice system in the world except for every place else. Yeah. And, um, and yes, we, we certainly have a number of problems uh, and a lot of problems based on race and class and economic station. Uh, but we have a process that privileges liberty. And that's a good feature of the criminal justice system. So here's how it works. The idea of the relationship between the individual and the state is such that in the United States, uh, we privilege uh, liberty over and above very many values, so much so that a statement by Increase Mather, not you know, terribly far from where we're sitting right now, has gained traction uh, over all these years. And it's that better 10 guilty go free than one innocent person convicted. Uh, that is an expression of the way in which uh, we understand liberty to operate in our collective consciousness. We would rather a bunch of guilty people go free than to than to um, impact the liberty interests of any uh, individual person. So that's a guiding principle in our criminal justice system, uh, liberty. Um, so we set uh, a process that makes it difficult to convict people. We have rules of procedure that are cumbersome and that slow down the process and that um, exclude otherwise reliable evidence. And this is all because we place a value on uh, liberty. And I think these are good things. And it uh, and it says a lot about our criminal justice system. Uh, some of the bad features uh, have to do with the way in which uh, uh, this country sees color as a proxy for criminality and and treats uh, people of color in radically different ways in the in the criminal justice system, uh, from uh, arrests to uh, charging decisions to sentencing. Uh, people of color are disproportionately uh, impacted uh, on all sorts of registers. Um, uh, one example, and it's a a, a popular one. Uh, that uh, although there appears to be no uh, distinguishable difference between uh, drug use by whites and blacks in the country, um, uh, blacks, though only 12 percent of the population represent 40 percent of the uh, the uh, drug charges in, in, in the country, there's 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 some disequities along uh, race and class and the criminal justice system that we really have to have to have to fix. And they've grown to more than than bugs in the system and have become features, unfortunately, of our features. system. Oh, to to make it more efficient, to make judgments. So the racism makes it more efficient. It uh, it, it it efficiently uh, moves people uh, from society to the streets uh and that's uh um and a lot of innocent people get caught up in that 